Hey folks, this is Vince with Ads Gaming Addiction, and once again, we're going to live stream Empires of the Undergrowth. This time I'm streaming on Twitch. I'm starting to get the hang of it, but uh, I may pause here and there just to check up on the stream and make sure everything's okay. I'm used to uh, live streaming on YouTube. So anyway, uh, let's just go ahead and jump into this. Um, let's go to our Formicarium. Continue. Now... I have played this countless times already, so I, I am hesitant to really dive into anything too deeply here because you guys have seen it already. With that being said, um, I don't know if we're going to see anyone. Uh, normally, I get about 20 people. Oh, hi, Peas Peas. There you are. Um, normally, I get about 20 people on my YouTube stream for this game, but um, yeah, now that we've got someone, actually, since you just arrived... Feel free to suggest a uh, level for me if you want to. Uh, the levels that are available should be the same as before. There's 1-1, one, 1-2, one, one, two, two, one, and 2-2. Two, two. Is there anything that you... Is there a particular level that you want to see? Or I normally play it on easy or medium. I'm a casual kind of player, not really hardcore. Rising tide it is. Okay, here we go. All right, I want to go ahead. I prefer the rapid fire ones myself, but that's just me. Um, I guess we'll play it on medium is fine. I love the narration in this game too. The voice acting is just excellent. This Formica Rufa wood ant queen has laid her first brood in a burrow near the sea. Her nest is just on the outskirts of the beach, the perfect vantage point for scavenging hapless morsels washed in by the tide. At the moment, the tide is out, but it won't stay that way. The ants must make haste and stockpile what they can, while they can. Alright, so let's get this food down so that we can actually expand our colony a bit. There we go. And I guess the I guess we'll start with the a couple of melee and then we'll work on I I do like the ranged ones better, the wood ants, but uh, they're a little bit more expensive. All right, if I remember correctly, okay, so the entrance is over here. Get a few more down. I absolutely love this game. The developers have done an excellent job with this game so far. Really enjoying it. Um, the content is slow, but at the same time, like, uh, the content being released is slow, but at the same time, they're doing, like, I'm glad that it's slow. I, I, I prefer them to take their time and to do it well. I can't wait to see what the final game Workers and spitters. Wow, that's a tough one. In my opinion, the melee ones are nice because they act like the tanks. They hold the bad guys at bay while the spitters... Because the spitters don't have as much health, I don't think, as the melee ones do. Well, anyway, let's go ahead and get outside and start collecting things. There is food to be found all over the beach. Yes, but the there wood is. must be cautious and choose their trails carefully. Tiger beetles frequent the higher ground, and they will make quick work of any wood ant that strays too close. Alright, so we're going to grab some initial food here. I like to get this, the food down here at the beach first, because that's where the water usually rises and covers everything up. But in the very beginning of this, like it's, it's usually beneficial to grab the food that's closest to you. Alright, food stores are full again. Let's go ahead and get uh, some wood ants down. I'm going to put some down. One, and I think each one is, what, 60? There we go, and there's two. Now, my workers are a bit... Yeah, they're a bit busy collecting food at the moment. I'm going to go ahead and unassign them so they can take care of this up here. And that leaves my melee ants on the surface. Oh, really? On Insane? Holy cow. 
I'm not that good. <laughs> yeah, I, I've never beaten it on insane or anything like that. I, I can only imagine what that's like. Alright, let's go ahead and grab some of this food here. I don't think the tiger beetles come up that far. There are other wood ants out here. They have also come to take advantage of the buffet provided by the sea. Territorial disputes will invariably favor the colony with the greater numbers. I'm glad to see that there are people that can actually do insane and and beat this. That's that's impressive. All right, more food is coming in. A hundred tiger beetles. What? One hundred seconds or one hundred? Must fight. I know that you can keep playing this level after you beat it, and it actually gets really difficult, but it's doable. That's a lot of tiger beetles, I'm just saying. Alright, uh, yeah, I don't want to mess with them either. We'll grab what food we can. Oh, what, do the, uh, do the mission after it's over? Yeah, sure. I should be able to. I do want to get a few more workers, too. This colony must remain small for now. Food is too scarce to support greater numbers. Uh, any lower and we risk antagonizing the beetles. There are... If we can time it right, we can grab some food from this. If we can time it right. All right, let's let's reconvene here. Once this tiger beetle leaves, we'll we'll quickly grab as much food as possible. All right. In the meantime, we'll get a few more food tiles. Tide the rises. Tide is coming in. Soon the lower levels of the beach will be flooded. Any ants caught in the surge will be washed out to sea. Oops. Don't want to do that. All right. Tiger beetle's still in the way here. All right. I think he's leaving. Oh. S stay there. Oh, no, no, no. All right, yeah, grab food and run. Grab food and run. You got it. Good job, ants. Okay, that's good. No, we're not going to get that risky. No, no. Back off. We got a, a good bundle of food there from that. There's also a little bit down here that we can grab. Oh, in order to beat insane. That that is that's impressive. I'm impressed. Food stores are full. Alright, well let's go ahead and get more ants cooking here. Well not literally cooking, but Alright, another worker ant back here. All right, and the next tide should be rising soon, so I don't want to head down here. I'm thinking maybe... The water is rising quickly. Yeah, yeah. The ants must head for higher ground. Eh, I don't think it's worth the risk. Those tiger beetles. All right. I'm thinking... We... Uh, that's also risky. They're just all over the place. 
go underground after the first wave? Really? Well, I, I, I stay underground after the first wave. I have to. Those crabs are tough to beat. If I remember incorrectly. Alright, well, let's get back underground, actually. Maybe we can dig out some tunnels real quick. And, um, un, un, reveal some of this food. Alright, there's some there. There's some there. Alright, I'm gonna unassign these workers so they can dig out a little bit more for me. Get some more room. Do you have this game? It's a lot of fun, I think. Actually, I'm gonna keep that there. I like I like creating like a little choke point right at this junction. I leave this wall here so that they're forced to come in through here. And that seems to work well for me. The tide has almost reached its highest point. Oh, okay. The sands east of the nest are about to be completely flooded. The first rising tide. Oh, I see what you're saying. Alright. Oh, that's cool. It's a great game. Well, looks like we opened up the wrong the tide one. Is in, and soon night will fall. As the temperature drops outside, nocturnal creatures begin to awaken. It would be wise for the Rufa colony to stay underground. Oh, uh, we'll be staying underground. The nest remains hidden until the morning. Overground, nocturnal hermit crabs rule over the sands at night. These creatures are typically scavengers, searching for algae and dead creatures on the beach. But due to the unusual incursion of Formica rufa colonies into this area, this particular community of crabs has developed a taste for ant flesh. Alright, we're about to get company. I'm gonna grab as much food as possible. Actually, let's get, let's get the workers down here doing that. A hermit crab has found its way into the nest. The ants must mount a swift and decisive defense. We'll need a steady supply of food if we're going to stave these guys off. Oh, that stinks. That's the that's the downside to PC gaming. It's it's hard to keep your computer up to date without a lot of money. Death throws, that's one. There's gonna be more crabs coming, I think. Let's assign group for yeah, let's assign this group of three and get this down here. We can always use it. I want to get some more workers, too. Without workers, we can't spawn new ants, so having them would be helpful. If I remember correctly, we're going to get attacked a few more times by various crab groups. Yep, I think there's one coming now. A group of hermit crabs have stormed the nest. 
The larvae must be protected. Oh, nice. Yeah, the royal jelly's nice for the upgrades. Strong puppy. My German Shepherd is just all about attention. What do you want? Huh? Those spitters, or those wood ants, definitely help. I call them spitters, but th they're called wood ants. I, I think the wood ants are definitely great against these crabs. Might as well combine them into one group. It'd be more helpful that way, I think. All right, we should see some more activity here pretty soon. Let's keep the wood ants coming. And it looks like we're still getting food from down here. Food stores are full. I guess we'll keep adding more. Got more incoming here pretty soon. There we are. More hermit crabs have found the nest. It's a shame I can't assign targets, like focus fire on a particular crab, but they seem to split their fire. Oh, we got them. We got them. It's going to be a nice bundle of food. All right, speaking of which, let's go ahead and upgrade some of these food tiles. Um, that I don't know. I've never played, uh, Insane. I think, well, that's not true. I think I did for my streamers once, but I got walloped. <laughs> it didn't take long for me to lose. I just wasn't fast enough. And it looks like we got all the food from down here. So I'm going to go ahead and unassign group one. Oh, wow. It's a lot. All right. Looks like the sun should be rising here pretty soon. The water effects are really nice, too. Dog, what are you doing? <laughs> Jumping around. All right. Yep. Water is the tide receding. Is receding, and a new day dawns. The hunters of the night return to the safety of the shadows, and the ants can begin to lay down new trails. The harvest must go on. All right, we're gonna grab as much as possible. Actually, let's start with the bottom level. I think it's better that way. That's where the tide hits first, then I wanna make try and I wanna try and clear its food contents before before that happens. Alright, in the meantime, our workers are kinda of doing nothing right now. I'm gonna assign one to group one and assign group one to maybe Yeah, let's go ahead and collect this food down here. There's no one down here. There's no one down here. I think it's safe to do that.
I can't wait to see the new ants that are going to be introduced to the game. I could have sworn I heard something about a leaf ant or something. Sounds pretty interesting. Oh. He stepped into the wrong battle. You know, that hurt. Alright, that should be everything here. Let's jump down here. Grab that stuff. Alright, looks like we're getting plenty of plenty of food again. I'm gonna go ahead and add some more way into the colony. And we'll also go ahead and maybe add a couple more workers. I'm going to go ahead and cl clear all this out. Oh, cool. I wonder if they'll have some sort of support role in this game. Alright, I think that's good. I don't want to push it. Let's get... Um at our ants over here to grab this stuff. I don't want to be on this bottom shelf when the tide starts to come back in. It usually takes the ants some time to actually get back to the other layer. I'm going to go ahead and unassign this one too. So in your opinion, uh, do you upgrade your ants or do you just build more of them? Because it costs the same amount to upgrade them as it does to build a new ant. So I'm just curious, what do you normally do? I personally like more ants as opposed to just one upgraded one, but that's just me. I like having a bunch of low-level ants swarming as opposed to a couple that are really upgraded. They can still get overwhelmed. Alright, so we got that. Uh, getting this... I don't know if the tiger beetle... Yeah, I don't think we're ready for that yet. Um, there's some over here. We'll go ahead and grab those. In the meantime, I'd like to get a few more of these, I call them melee ants because they're like tanks, but it's not really what they are. 
they hold the line while the spitters do all the damage. At least in my in my army, that's what they do. I love how beautiful this game is too. It's just, it's awesome. That right, looks like we got all the food here. There's a, just a little bit more up here. I think we'll grab the that. The tide is coming in. Uh oh. Soon the lower levels of the beach will be flooded. Any ants caught in the surge will be washed out to sea. That's okay. We're on the level above the one that's being flooded. Yeah, this is going to be flooded, and then this one. So we've we've got some time to get this food here. Now that's cool. Nothing wrong with that. Whatever like you're interested in whatever makes you happy, that's what you should go for for sure. And it's never too late no matter how old you are. I'm 37, but you know, I could still do other things if I so choose. I didn't really get into live streaming till I was like 34, 35. Alright, looks like we got all the food from that. Uh, don't want to risk that yet. Alright, let's get back underground with this group and we'll dig out more passages for the night. So I'm going to have them all convene here, and we'll dig this out. The water is rising quickly. The ants must head for higher ground. Ooh, they didn't last too long there. All right, um, let's go ahead and get some more wood ants. Yeah, I've seen Ants Canada before. He's a little dramatic, but I I do like I I do respect his uh, knowledge and how well he knows his you know his stuff. Like he's very experienced. I'm sure the drama is for you know, for flair and for camera and showmanship and stuff. But sometimes it's a little too much for me. But I can see where it might be exciting to kids and. You know, keep them interested. There are intruders in the nest. The tide has almost reached its highest point. The sands east of the nest are about to be completely flooded. Well, we are demolishing these food stores very quickly. Oh, he's a singer too. No kidding. I had no idea. That I didn't know. That's awesome. It goes to show you that you shouldn't limit yourself to one talent if you got it. Alright, I'm actually going to wait on, because we're going to get hit again with crabs and other things. So I'm going to, I'm going to park my guys right there at the entrance. Anything that walks into my base is going to get them. There is another creature roaming the sands tonight. Oh, the wolf spider. Arctosa littoralis, the beach wolf spider. Ooh. In the day, these spiders retreat to the shade provided by larger plants on the edge of the beach. Oh, there they are. But once the sun is gone... They are far more active. Very fast. They hunt for a midnight feast. I'm surprised these things don't attack each other. Ooh, yeah, those things are nasty, these things. Oh. 
I like arachnophobia mode. It puts hats on them, but it doesn't it doesn't have the same effect. Oh, here here comes one now. A wolf spider has found the nest entrance. She's and he's only dead. Small, but her venom will quickly incapacitate any ant that tries to fight alone. Well, that didn't happen. We we she walked into about 7,000 ants. That's I don't care what kind of spider you are. We'll see more spiders before the night's out for sure. I like to surround my queen because uh, these spiders will get past, will get past you, and even though you've got like a little wall built up here, they'll still get past that and attack your queen. So I like to, I like to sort of hang around my queen, guard it so that there's no possible way the the spider can get to him, or her. Right, upgrade our food stores a bit more. Okay, we've got enough for a thousand food at this point. How are we doing on the surface? Well, so far no crabs are attacking, but they usually spawn out of this little hole here if they do attack. They're just sort of roaming around right now. Oh, these things are really creepy. Oh, those noises too. I wouldn't be pissing that crab off. Just saying, that crab's just walking all over him. Oh, got company. Another wolf spider has entered the nest. This one is large, fast, and voracious. And didn't last too long. That's okay, we only lost a couple ants. Not, no big deal. Oh yeah, they're very knowledgeable too. I, I spoke to them on their one of their live streams and they were really nice. Really nice guys. Okay, let's do... I generally don't do those speed-up tiles either. I'm pretty sure we have enough ants now to take on those tiger beetles. Yeah, 55. That's plenty. We'll start with the tiger beetles on the lower levels and then work our way up. Uh oh, more spiders. More wolf spiders have found the nest. Nice. Yeah, those those wood ants really come in handy. I can see why that one guy favored them in insane mode. Alright, the tide should be rising shortly here.
The only thing I wish I had was like a fast forward button. Because there are times like this where the game sort of drags, but I guess if you're new to the game, it's very helpful. Yep, mm-hmm. They come from this little hole here. Mm -hmm. All right, looks like the water is receding. Uh, let's As go ahead and... rises over a new day. The tide recedes. Let's just, the nocturnal creatures yeah. return to the shadows, and once again, the harvest must continue. Well, we're going to be harvesting tiger beetles here very shortly. We've got plenty of ants to do it now. The ants have been spotted by Chichindela dorsalis, the beach tiger beetle. With its long, slender legs, it's the king of speed on these intertidal flats. Its wide carving jaws will slice effortlessly through squads of wood ants. It's going to take a monumental unified effort to bring this beast down. So you say... We're spitting it, all of that venom in the face. I think we're fine. Nice. Two tiger beetles down. All right, let's go ahead and go after these down here. There's more food here that we didn't get from before. We are now officially on a mission. We can send these workers up here to grab the rest of this. The battle has begun. Okay, that takes care of that corpse. Funnel web spiders, huh? It ate a tiger beetle? Really? That's cool. I'd love to see that. That would be fun to watch. Alright, so it looks like we got the rest of this food from here. Let's send these guys, um... Let's get this food down here. I bet it was. That's something I really would have liked to have seen.
Okay, we may not even have to go down here for food. We still have some food left over in our base. I mean, we've got... Yeah, we've got this area. We've got this area that we could dig out for food if we really needed it, but I don't think we do. This right here was a big... A big victory. The ants must defend themselves. All right, so it looks like we're out down there. Let's grab whatever we can here. All right, food stores are full again. Let's go ahead and build some more workers just to have them. The ants will fight to the death. I'm going to keep I'm going to keep some ants handy here just in case, sort of like a royal guard kind of thing. I guess we could also use them to get this food over here. In fact, let's go ahead and do that now. I'm just going to clear this away. There's only one enemy right here. All right, tide's rising. The tide soon. is coming in. Soon the lower levels of the beach will be flooded. Any ants caught in the surge will be washed out to sea. Yeah, those wolf spiders are nasty, and for it to eat a wolf spider, that's pretty powerful. Predators are loose in the nest. The larvae must be protected. Quickly, the ants must head for higher ground. have done all they can to prepare this brood chamber. Oh, that's it. Alright, I guess we'll hang out here until nightfall. There's nothing else for me to really do at this point. Yeah, pretty soon this is going to get covered. And this will be the last night, too. I, mean, I guess we can be thorough and dig all this out. Just for the heck of it.
The tide has almost reached its highest point. The sands east of the nest are about to be completely flooded. Tide is in, and soon night will fall. As the temperature drops outside, nocturnal creatures begin to awaken. All right, it will be last wise night. For the roofer colony to stay underground and hope that their nest remains hidden until the morning. We got plenty of ants. Nothing to worry about there. A wolf spider has found the nest. Oh, that was quick. Food stores are full yet again. Okay. Let's see if we can upgrade anything before we build more. Yeah, we can. All right, wolf spiders, come get me. I'm confident. Now, I wonder if they upgrade immediately or if they only upgrade when they're... No, oh, it says two there. I thought maybe they only spawn whenever they only upgrade when they spawned a new one, but I don't think that's the case. Because I am seeing some twos in here. Oh, we got some company. I think that might be a crab. It's too slow to be a spider. Yeah, here they come. More hermit crabs have found the nest. These hermit crabs should fall pretty quickly here. I just want to see if something works. It's fine. Well, no, I just need your give an account on Twitch. Oh, okay. Uh, look me up real quick and see. Follow me and see if it pops up on here. I'm testing it to see if the follower notification works. That was my son. In case you were curious, he's 17.
pretty soon we should be seeing some wolf spiders just try and overwhelm the nest. I think it's like one large one and a bunch of baby ones, if I remember right. Ah, there they go. A huge wolf spider has found the colony. This one is a mother, and her recently hatched brood have followed her into the nest. These ants are facing an overwhelming infestation. Yeah, that spider. Yeah. We're fine. That damage over time venom that she's got, though, that's really nasty. Might as well dig the rest of this out. We don't need that anymore. Oh, yeah, there he is. At least I know the follower notification works. Yeah, it worked. Oh, to keep playing? Yeah. We'll play for maybe another night or two, and then I gotta... There's a couple of games that I recently got that I have to cover off camera or off uh, live stream. I think one of them was called Symmetry and the other one I don't remember the name of. I keep wanting to say like Full Metal Alchemist, but I know that's not it. It's like Full Metal Fury or something like that. Well, we dug out everything in here. Again, this is where a fast forward button would be nice. As the ants grow in number, the local predators pose less and less of a danger. Eventually, they will be displaced from this area entirely. Despite the dangers of the beach, it seems this intrepid queen's gamble to establish her colony here has ultimately secured her success. All right, uh, reward. I'm going to go with the royal jelly for whenever we get new stuff. I want to make sure we've got enough to unlock. All right, play more. Now, I don't know. If I remember correctly, I only get attacked at night again. But that's okay. We'll, we'll go ahead and go after these tiger beetles. Get some easy food. The ants must fight. Have you seen uh, the stuff past this? Like, have you gone... Have you kept playing, so to speak, and messed around with this part of it? That is a lot of tiger beetles. All right, let's let's get reinforcements here. We need to go at them all at once. Yeah, attacking tiger beetles one or two at a time is not going to cut it. Unified effort.
We can always send our workers up here to get this stuff. Yeah, let's do that. And we need more, we need more ants. All right, what I'm going to do is, uh, I think, I think more wood ants is the answer. Just build a whole bunch. This colony must remain small for now. Food is too scarce to support greater numbers. All right, that's good. We've got 102 wood ants. I sincerely hope that's enough. Oh boy. One down, two down. Three down. Four down. Oh, there's more. Six. That's a lot of tiger beetles. Well, we managed to get them. That is a lot of food. Necessary, though. It costs five food to replace a fallen ant, so. Alright, looks like our worker ants are still getting these. Almost done, though. 35 left here, 20 left here. Alright, let's bring this group down here. And maybe take on these. Now these ants don't give me anything. So I'm thinking maybe the the tiger beetles down here. And this food source. Oh boy. Well, that tiger beetle didn't last too long. And that's all of them there. There are some tiger beetles down here, but I don't know if we can get to them before the tide rises up to that point. All right, food stores are full anyway. Let's go ahead and get some more. Um, yeah, I'm gonna just for giggles. I'm gonna go ahead and get a couple more of these just to have them. But I do want to concentrate on the wood ants. The tide is coming in. Soon the lower levels of the beach will be flooded. Any ants caught in the surge will be washed out to sea. Okay, so yeah, let's head back. Night should be interesting.
we've got about 500 food or so for night. I mean, we will get food from any animals that might be invading. Oh, let's go ahead and send these guys back too. Go and check on my stream real quick, make sure it's all good. Okay, it looks like it. Oh, nice. It'd be cool if I could actually see who was all watching. Like, I can see the chat room, but I can't see who's actually in here. All right, I'm back. All right, tide's rising in another few seconds. These poor ants are going to get it. Ugh. Dead ants. They seem to be spawning from somewhere in here. I wonder if there's like a little little nest here. I can't see it very well. But they keep coming in and out of this area. There's still a little food left there, but again, I'm not I'm not going to chance it. I I just I would be devastating to lose 100 ants. Oh, you're awake. Hi. I'm on Twitch. Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I did Twitch a couple of times just to test it, and it's actually pretty nice. I can actually see when someone follows the me, The tide too. has almost reached its highest point. Pretty the cool. The sands east of the nest are about to be completely flooded. Hmm? It's long overdue. Yeah, it is long overdue. Now I need to recruit a whole band of followers again. I don't have Ishwad, I don't have King Bobcat, I don't have, you know, all those other... Not at the same time, I don't think, no. Mm -mm. If you can, if you can stream to both YouTube and Twitch at the same time, that would be interesting. I upload Twitches to YouTube. Just to keep all the videos in one place. All right, so night should be falling here, and we should be seeing some really nasty creatures coming out. Now, with this being not part of the campaign, we should see a huge attack here. Luckily, we've got... We've got 700 food reserve in case we have to quickly spawn some more ants, but... And I'm just sort of just hovering over my queen to try and protect it. Oh, yeah, we got spiders incoming. Wow. Wasn't too bad. We'll be seeing more, I'm sure. These crabs would make some nice food if I could lure them over to where I am. But I also don't want to leave my queen undefended either. I could create like a second group. Um, purely for that. Like, I've got 23 here. Let's go ahead and create a separate group of wood ants. Solely for being on the surface 
and dealing with uh, nearby nearby swarms or nearby uh, sources of food. Oh, we're about to be attacked, possibly. Nope, they're just gonna they're gonna pass us by. I've never seen them get that close before, though, from another hole. Yeah, I don't think I could lure them either. The best I could do is sit outside my entrance here with this group, and anything passing by, I can attack, and then if I kill it, I can bring the food underground. I could try that. And I still have my huge group here defending my queen, so that shouldn't be a problem. Oh my! All right, back underground. All right, we need we need to strengthen numbers at this point. They, they brought the food to me. Isn't that convenient? Alright, I'm going to go ahead and bring these guys back up to the surface. Try and get any passing crabs. Wow, that was over a thousand worth of food. And climbing. Those were a lot of spiders, though, to be fair. Oh, there's still a spider down here. Right, I'm going to go ahead and spawn uh, some more wood ants for this group. Back underground, it's too, no. Back underground. We've got a lot of spiders incoming again. Oh, oh man, look at all that. That's a lot of dying ants. Oh, is it really? It is insane, for sure. Alright, luckily, it looks like that wave just died off. Just in time, too. Alright, look at all that food. It's if, if you can survive the onslaught, it's not so bad. But, more. Do you? Um, uh, I, I can look. I thought I turned that off personally, but I, I can check real quick while I'm waiting for the next wave. All right, so.
Actually, let me just check the settings. Oh, okay, must have. Okay, zero minutes. I don't know if it'll work for you or if it has to. That worked. Okay. Hi there. Did you go with Nev plays or? Yeah. Okay. I guess the water is receding at this point. Is Does the difficulty get any worse than this? I mean, like, I'm hoping it does. Because if that's all it had, then, you know, I'm confident that I could just keep going forever with this. Oh, it gets worse. Okay, so we need to re, yeah, regroup with group four here. Group five's doing just fine. All right, we need more ants. Look at the bottom of the map. What's at the bottom of the map? Oh, you mean all the different, all the tiger beetles you mean, or? All right, ants are full again. All right, let's do more of these. Extend these out a bit. And of course, more wood ants. Lots of beetles. Yeah, absolutely. There's only three there. I'm not too worried about them. All right, food stores are full. I'm gonna have to build some more, or spawn some more of these wood ants. Oh, I didn't want to join these two though. I wanted two separate groups. There we go. With only OBS, and you have to download a third software. And oh yeah, I'm... next to the settings button. Oh, okay, cool. Thanks. Yeah, you, you can tell I don't use Twitch very often. More than insane? How how could you possibly have more than insane? I guess it's called ludicrous difficulty. Alright, um, let's try and get some of this food down here. 
We'll, we're gonna need it. We have none in reserve, and I don't like that. Those are some definite death throws. Okay, so we got the majority of the tiger beetles. I mean, granted, there's another group down here, but I don't know when that tide's coming in. Probably soon. Okay, so we got all the food. Tide's rising. I think it's time to head back home. Get the last of this stuff here. Looks like we just did. Okay. Destroy all tigers? I don't know if I can. With only... Yeah, we, we're gonna... This is gonna rise in a couple of seconds. And then this is going to rise in about a minute or a minute and a half. I don't want to lose all of my ants trying to escape the, the rising tide. But maybe in the next, uh, the next day. This is probably going to be the last night. What time is it? It is 7.30. Yeah, like I said, I got those other games to get to. So this will be the last night, I think. It's a shame I can't save my progress. That would have been fun. But I've got... 270 ants guarding my queen at this point, so I'm hoping that'll be enough. Yep, 30 seconds until the next tide. That would have been a very close... Oh, they're running. Alright, these poor ants are going to bite the big one here. Ugh. They didn't make it.
All right, at this point, we're just waiting, waiting for night to fall. Walk the Freelands. They're not going to be very free pretty soon. These ants aren't going to make it either. Ugh. I guess it would be a better idea for me just to stay here. We know that there's going to be a crap ton coming. No need to lure anyone to my cave. We've got we've got plenty. Oh, here comes some spiders now. Oh, they're okay. This one's just wandering by. As is that one. Oh, here they come. I wasn't so bad. I wasn't bad at all. Food stores are full again. I'm surprised. The baby attack. Yeah. Wonder where they're wonder where they're at. I'm gonna guess they're just they're they're building up their forces as we speak. I'm sure they'll be coming any second. Oh here they come. I see red. This can't be good. Oh boy, here we go. Again, not too bad. Having 270 spiders available really helps. <laughs> yeah, they are pretty gross, aren't they? You mean these larvae here? These little white larvae? Yeah. It's a bit realistic. Hmm. 
Food stores are full again. That's a good sign. Dog, seriously. <laughs> Gotta chew your nail. The mother's raptors. Ooh, okay, that's a lot. It sounds like popcorn. All those ants that are dying and coming back. I wouldn't mind it. Uh, I wouldn't mind an Empires of the Undergrow Teeth shirt. I don't know if they make them, but that'd be pretty fun. I can only imagine what kind of designs would be on that thing. Well, we're full up on food. We staved off that huge attack. I'd say uh, this colony is pretty successful. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and put a cut in the stream here. I, again, I've got some more stuff to do off camera but if you guys uh, want to see more of this let me know if you guys haven't already subscribed to my channel and check out my official website www.dadsgamingaddiction.com this is vince thanks for watching and i'll catch you guys next time take care